Hey guys, it's Di and welcome to the grocery haul today. So this is our very first holiday haul and welcome to the vlogs. Vlogmas is ahead of us and I'm looking forward to having a little bit more regular vlogs, although we've been vlogging pretty regularly since I've been home, I guess semi-permanently now. Uh, but anyhow, we are planning on doing Vlogmas vlogs, so I'm um, looking forward to that. But today's our first holiday haul. You can see just a little bit of holiday peeking from behind. This is also Thanksgiving week, so we are getting ready for Thanksgiving holiday. But we are just planning on being here at the house, and it's just going to be us at the house. And I've already got turkey and most of the stuff that we need for that kind of already tucked away. Um, actually, I need to get that out and defrost it here pretty soon and so it's just gonna be us for Thanksgiving but I thought I would take you through some of the other things that I got for this week as per usual we are all around the house the kids are doing virtual school my husband and I are working at home and we're eating pretty much all of our meals at the house these days also um, I'm sure you've watched the news and <laughs> things are getting a little dicey out there so we're really not planning on going a whole lot of different places so this is kind of our supplies um, I don't know if you guys have started having some of like the food shortage issues again or toilet paper and paper towels and been super common to be a shortage um, but we started seeing that in our area but luckily we got everything on this grocery order there was no substitutions so we kind of hit this one just right so let's jump into it um, I got some sandwich bread the kids use this for you know grilled cheese or if I'm doing like a PB&J there's hamburger buns we're actually going to be doing a turkey sloppy joes with the ground turkey and then some manwich here um, I got some canned chicken. I use that when I'm putting it into pasta or also the chicken biscuit dish that I do. It's kind of like a chicken pot pie but it uses biscuits. So we're going to be doing that this week as well. Some carrots for just munching on and also that chicken biscuit meal. Radishes. Isabella especially loves radishes. It's my husband's salad that he eats every night with dinner. There's some celery. This is also for that chicken biscuit dish which I've showed in a couple vlogs, um, but if you want the link to one where I show it, I'll try to find one. Um, some A1, we usually use this with um, like pork chops or anything like that because we don't really eat a whole lot of red meat anymore. My nails are all busting up too, by the way, from putting all the trees up this weekend. <laughs> so there's that. Um, I got a couple rices to have on hand. There's a butter and garlic and a roasted chicken just to have more of like fish and stuff like that. Oil and vinegar for my husband's salad, the dressing he uses. Bubble fruit, Isabella loves these. These are the peach, strawberry, lemonade, little cups. And they have the little bubbles in them. We all really like those little bubbles, it's really good. For the biscuits, I got this little pack of biscuits. It usually works better to have five biscuits instead of a full pack to do the chicken biscuit thing. And we also got pork chops. We're gonna have those one night. So that's two of the meals right there. The ground turkey, sloppy joes, and pork chops. Then we actually hadn't had chicken nuggets in a really long time, and the kids both like those, so I got some chicken nuggets and tater tots to have. Um, it's just the crispy round ones for the kids one night, so that's the third meal. We'll, of course, have turkey and all the sides, which will be another day, so that's four. Vegetable chip mix. My husband gets this, but it's kind of a good snack in the middle of the afternoon. A bunch of his Greek yogurts. He eats one of those every single morning. If you didn't catch my video on the cocoa bar, it's over here and it's super, super fun. I When I originally got the items for it, they did not have any regular candy canes at the stores I was at. So I ordered this on our grocery order and got these just for some more fun varieties on those cocoa boards. And if you guys really like that video, I'm planning on doing some more of those. So if you guys enjoyed that type of video, I can do videos on it going forwards in the future too. But it was a really fun like pick me up the week, just putting it together and then having hot cocoa with the kids. So I think I'm definitely gonna be doing some more of those in different variations. And our home goods, a couple people already asked when I posted these online, our home Home goods was where I found this little snowman they actually had a Santa too so I want to go back and see if I can find the Santa because it just makes it so fun when like the mugs are part of the display that's so so cute anyhow segue um, this is my coffee it's been actually hard to find and out of stock but luckily I was able to get a big pack of this go go squeeze for the kids mini spooners for my husband it's kind of like shredded wheat but he prefers I think it's this brand he prefers one of the off-brands 
and the last time that there was like food shortages and stuff was hard to find. This was one of the things, weirdly, that started to become hard to find. So he's, you know, already started talking about that again. Some protein bars for him. This is the coffee made I use, sugar-free French vanilla. Some apples for everyone. A couple lactose-free milks. And a couple white grape peach juices. And an almond milk as well. So that's our grocery haul for the week. And I'm planning on making chili tonight in the crock pot. I already have everything for that. And I think that covers all the meals because there's one, two, three. Oh, we have a pizza in the freezer too. So turkey and pizza are already in the freezer. I'm making chili tonight. And then there's four meals here in the grocery haul. So that is what our kind of holiday kickoff grocery haul looks like. Hopefully you guys are having a great start to your holiday season. I know that this is one of my favorite times of the year. It just makes me so happy to have all of the holiday stuff around the house. And I'm looking forward to sharing vlogs with you all. I'm looking forward to you sharing your traditions with me and how you're handling it this year. And wow, I'm just really excited that it's this time of the year because it's one of my favorite times of year and it just brings me a lot of joy. So let me know if you have any questions down below. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're staying safe. Hope you're staying well. And we will be seeing you in some Vlogmas vlogs that are right around the corner very, very soon. Thanks for watching and have a great day.